everyone, so it's the end of August, which means it's time for September favorites, which is what I'll be doing today. Um, I skipped my July favorites, I think, because there were just not enough things to actually mention. But now that we're slowly getting our way into fall, as you can see, I'm in my really cozy sweater and the rain is blasting outside. So, um... I guess all of these products are kind of meant for back to school and overall just the seasons changing because we had had kind of a rainy August and we are kind of preparing for back to school because I go next week. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. So I'm going to start off with my favorite foundation of the month which has been the Vichy Norma there. Now this is a French pharmacy brand um, foundation and I absolutely loved it. Basically um, this whole line is meant for acne prone, kind of maybe even teenage or adult acne prone skin. And I adore it. The only thing that I kind of don't like but I feel like a lot of people would is that it has a really matte finish. And since I have oily skin, even on me, it kind of did last very long time. Usually foundations after an hour I'm like an oil mess. So I definitely recommend this if you really like that matte finish. Um, what I like about it is that it's safe for acne prone skin, that it helps even clear them out, which is something that I really appreciate in a foundation. So overall for acne prone skin, I would definitely recommend this, especially for this back to school season. I think this is really good because it lasts a really long time. Another MAC product that I've been loving this month has been the MAC Mineralize Skin Finish Natural and I got it in the color Light Plus which is right now kind of light for me but I really really love this. On days when I don't want to wear foundation or that I'm just kind of doing errands or anything I love just you know dusting it over my face because it, it's not mattifying but it controls the oil that it's not too oily but it gives a really nice and natural set and finish and I absolutely adore it. I think that this really is a cult product and I can now, once I've tried it, really see why I absolutely adore it. And if you're looking for a good powder, I think that this is a really good option. We all know that I hate wearing colored nail polish for school because I don't... I just feel like it's too much and I really like, you know, the whole neutral look for school. So, um, I've been kind of getting in the whole look of that lately, so I've been loving the Essie nail polish in Allure. Um, just a really pretty milky color, very natural, doesn't look like anything on the nails except that it makes your nails look really nice and clean and healthy and that's the look that I really like. So I recommend this for back to school season as well. Now my skincare discovery of the month has been green clay mask. <laughs> Basically this, this works on your skin like a magnet. Once you apply it kind of thickly it will drag out all the impurities and in a few days all your blemishes will be like gone. And this whole big jar doesn't like cost a lot of money and it will last you a long time and it just looks really cool because it's like really really green. I'm gonna show you. This is how it looks. Um, as you can see I've used quite a bit of it. Um, I usually apply it even a few, a few times a week and um, I really just like the feeling of it on my skin. You just let it dry and then you rinse it off. It's really simple and the results are crazy. You will have the smoothest, the nicest skin. I um, use it in place of my exfoliator because it, this is kind of grainy. So it will uh, shook off all of your dead skin cells that may be resting on your skin causing blockage. And um, I really think this is a good thing to have. And my last favorite for this month's favorites video is going to be something that I mentioned in my back to school haul, which I'm going to link in the bottom right if you want to see it. It's the Yankee Candle in Pink Dragon Fruit. Um, once I got this candle, I thought that the scent is going to be really overpowering, but once you start burning it, it's so nice and subtle. Because I have a really small bedroom, so you know anything that's really sweet or intense can be really overwhelming for a small space. But it's not, it's like really nice and fresh and you can't even like feel it once you get in the room, which is everything great because I hate scents that kind of give you a headache once you start burning it. So I absolutely adore the Yankee candles if you don't like over scented candles. Um, right now I'm actually burning a White Gardenia, which is another one for, from the haul and it just smells really clean and nice and you can't even like scent it. 
I don't know, I just really love them. So I would definitely recommend the Yankee Candles if you're looking for nice and gentle scents for your bedroom. So guys, that's it for my monthly favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you're a new viewer, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Uh, if you'd like, you can follow me on Twitter. I really tweet a lot and I love when you guys like interact with me on Twitter or Instagram. The links will be at the top of the bottom bar. And um, I love when you guys leave me comments, so please don't forget to do that. And um, I'll talk to you guys soon in my next video. Bye!